morning everyone and welcome back to another vlog. Today is Saturday? Yeah, today's Saturday and I thought I would do a little bit of a, perhaps a day in a life, perhaps a weekend vlog. I'm not really sure yet, it depends how busy I am and how much I actually remember to get the camera out. Um, so yeah, today I'm starting the vlog a little bit later, it's about 11 o'clock, but we are up and dressed. Um, by we, I mean me and Finley. Uh, Ryan is working... I think he's working a private job today. I think he's doing the race for life. Um, I'm not really sure. So either way, he's at work. <laughs> um, so yeah, it's just me and Finley today, and I've just filmed a Primark video. But yeah, <laughs> I'm actually being watched at the moment. Finley is like fascinated by this camera. Um, I'll see if I can show you. Where's the smiles? <laughs> That's it. Yeah, smiles. <laughs> um. So yeah, like I said, we're going to head out because it's nap time and he doesn't seem to want to nap in the house. So I figured either being in the pram or being in the car might help get him to sleep. I just can't decide what to do. I could do is pop into Aldi to pick up some more nappies. And someone mentioned yesterday that they had the small children's like baby paddling pools and they were really cheap and they had like a sunshade thing over them. So I didn't know whether to go and grab one of those. Um... <laughs> He's still watching me. Um, or whether to walk to our local shop and just pick up something nice to snack on, just to go out for a walk. Um, oh, I just don't know what to do. The weather doesn't look fantastic, but that's okay. I can put a coat on if need be. But anyway, I'm going to stop waffling and try and work out what we're going to do because this little baby needs to sleep. <laughs> So we decided to come for a little walk to, and I thought we'd just go to one of the local um, shops. We've got a co-op near where we live. Um, don't really need anything but I don't really fancy sitting in the house and I thought it'd be quite nice to go out for a walk. Um, but yeah, we're now walking down this path. Ryan said it's quicker to go this way because last time we walked along the main road but he said that there's this sort of cut through path as you can probably tell behind me. Um, so yeah, we're giving this a go. Finney's in the pram. He's not asleep yet. So this could be a real disaster if he doesn't go to sleep soon because he hasn't had his morning nap yet. I'm really hoping he falls asleep though because we're in the danger zone at the moment. Um, but yeah, I've never walked down this way before. I didn't even know this was here and I've lived in this area for sort of eight, nine years nearly. Eight years? Yeah. Um, there's huge rugby fields here that I didn't know were here either. Didn't know they were there. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go for the co-op, grab a mooch around, and then um, I'm gonna go home. Probably he'll wake up by then, feed him. Uh, that's if he goes to sleep. Feed him, and then I might pop out to Aldi because there's something that I've seen that I would like to go and pick up. So we'll see how the day goes. But at the moment, we're wandering along this path, not having a clue where we're going. Sleeping. Hey, why are you not sleeping? So as you might be able to tell, the, um, the baby isn't in the pram anymore. And he's not happy because he's not slept, so he's now in the carrier. I just thought I'd show you what I picked up in the co-op. I was hoping to put him back in, but obviously not. So I just picked up some rolls for lunch, um, some cornflake clusters, um, this drink, which I was going to drink on the way home, except my cup holder is actually in the car, and some jelly babies. Sweating how it is hot out there. Whew. But we are finally home from the co-op. It is so humid outside. I had to push the prowl up this huge hill. Whew, shouldn't have done that in the middle of the day, but there we go. Um, Finley is now awake because the transfer from the pram to the house did not go to plan. So he's only had about 20 minutes sleep. So I'm going to make some lunch and then hopefully see if he'll settle down and go back to sleep with me. Um, because 20 minutes all morning is not good. <laughs> so yeah, that's the plan. I'm going to make some lunch because I'm hungry now. 
Does anyone else have like the most weirdest lunches? I've got some chicken and cucumber rolls, some apple and some french fries. Morning everyone, happy Monday. We have come to Cardiff today. Um, so I thought I'd bring you along with me. I didn't finish the vlog the other day, so I thought I'd just carry on today. Um, Ryan is off today, so we've come to get a few bits in town and then maybe pop to Ikea. Um, but yeah, he's just putting the pram up for me. It's nice having someone to help me out and to lift everything out of the boot. But yeah, we've just got to St David's in Cardiff, so let's go have a nose around the shop. So we are back in the car now, we've finished in Ikea and we managed to get the high chair and it was actually on offer, I didn't say there was an offer but we paid I think £15 for the whole thing um, and that includes an insert as well and the insert I think was £6 so absolute bargain. Um, I don't think we're going to put it up just yet because he's still a little bit too young but I wanted to have it because I think in the next few weeks he'll be able to hold his head up a lot better so he can sit in there and sort of play while I make dinner in the kitchen and things like that. Um, so yeah, he's just feeding now and then we're going to head off to the next place. Good morning everyone. Um, today is Tuesday, I have to think about that. Um, and we're just going to have a sort of, I say a lazy day at home, we're just having a day at home really, getting a few bits and pieces done. Um, Finley's down here, back in, he's actually in the same outfit he was in the other day, um, because the washing machine is on every day in this house now. But um, yeah, we're not really up to much today because we've got things to go to for the next few days. Um, and I'm having a bit of a no makeup day because something has reacted with my skin this morning. I came out of the shower and it was like that and it's got a lot of heat in it and it's um, a little bit sore so yeah and I have a really red face which is lovely um, but yeah I've just literally ran around got both of us ready jumped in the shower um, made the beds grabbed some breakfast let the dog out in the garden and had a quick play with her um, and now I think Finley's probably ready for are you ready for something to eat? yeah yeah, I think he's going to have something to eat and then hopefully have a little bit of a nap and I'm going to try and get some blog posts written, I've got some emails to send, um, what else, I have a video to edit and some blog posts to write so I probably won't get all of that done while he's asleep, definitely not but I thought I'd crack on with a few of those bits. Ready. Um, mm, 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 mm. Right, so Finley has had his first nap and to be honest, I didn't really get much done. Um, I don't really know what I was doing. I started writing a blog post but didn't really get very far with that one. Um, and he's awake now. He's in his little chair, he's just been changed. Um, 
and I've decided that I'm going to rearrange the living room a little bit because um, I was saying to my mum the other day that he has like toys up in his bedroom and um, everything's laid out so that he can just lay there and use everything as and when it's all upstairs. Oh dear. Um, so yeah, his bedroom has got toys and stuff in it and it's ideal if we're upstairs, he can use anything in there and things like that. But the living room, there's not really much that he can play with down here other than like his chair that he's sat in. Oh yeah, which clearly he's enjoying. Um, oh, I think this could be an Amazon delivery. Hold that thought. Okay, so like I was saying, yeah, the living room is a bit boring really. There's not really much for him to play and interact with. Um, so I bought a few pieces, which you'll have seen in my three to six month baby haul. Um, and I've picked up a few more pieces yesterday and I ordered a few bits last night. So <laughs> um, the idea being that I'm gonna rearrange the living room a little bit and then I'm gonna lay out some toys so that he's got somewhere to play and then I'm gonna buy a basket I think um, that can go in the living room that I can put toys in and then I can get out different toys each day and sort of rotate them around to keep it interesting for him I guess um, and then I'm gonna leave all of his other toys upstairs still because obviously that means there'll be different toys upstairs for him to interact and play with um, but it means that no matter where we are there's something he can do because I feel like he's getting to that age now where he needs to be entertained and he's not um, he's not going to be sitting cuddled all day like he is when like he was when he was a newborn if that makes sense um, so yeah I thought I would show you a sort of bit of before and after I would say before and after I've already started sort of tearing the living room apart but basically I'll show you what the living room looks like at the moment okay so this is our living room Clearly, obviously, it's quite small, so the coffee table, I think, is going to have to be moved. Um, Finley is in here at the moment. So, like I said, this is, like, his chair that he plays in. Um, and he's down there at the moment. Um, oh, I picked these up yesterday in... Uh, where were they? Home Bargains. And they were about 6 99 for 100 um, because I bought the paddling pool and I thought I could put them in there for when the weather's not so great and you can't actually sit in the, in the water um, but you can get them on Amazon as well so I'll link them down below um, that is a package I need to open I'm about to hoover um, and sort of rearrange things a little bit so here we go cue the time lapse <laughs> Okay, so this is some um, foam flooring that I bought from Aldi. It was about £7.99. Um, it was in my recent haul. I will link a similar one from Amazon because um, I found that one afterwards, but I'm going to put this down now. <laughs> Okay, so this is what I've put out for now. Um, I'm going to, obviously, like I said, change the toys around on a daily basis. And I've ordered a few things that I'm waiting for. Um, but yeah, there is this spare play mat that I've got. This is from TK Maxx, the Fox one. And I think it was about £15. So if I can find that, I will link that down below as well. Um, then I've got this Tummy Time book, which again was in my most recent haul. Um... It's got lots of fun things for him to look at and play with and touch and I think that's probably one of the best five pounds I've ever spent and again that was from Amazon and then I've brought this one down which was actually a present from his auntie and uncle and cousins um, so I thought that one would be fun for him to play with because there's loads of different fabrics and noises and stuff and then I might get some of the balls out and yeah are you having fun down there? Yeah. Ooh. Okay, so as you can probably tell, we've rearranged a little bit. I've put a few different toys out, um, and I'm, obviously I'm still waiting for the others to be delivered. His chair's still in the living room. The Moses basket is over there in case we need it. Um, I thought because the radiator's on at the moment, then I could just move it over there. Um, 
we have a jumper that's come in as well so that'll come into the living room so that he can use that on a daily basis um i've bought his high chair so that when i'm in the kitchen in like probably a few weeks time he'll be able to sit in his high chair and watch me make dinner and things like that and he can have some toys on there so yeah i'm excited for all these other bits and pieces to come now because obviously it means i can change the toys up all i need to do now is find some sort of storage solution i've seen what i want to get him for his bedroom um a toy box for his bedroom and i just want to get one for the living room as well so that i can put some toys down here and then like i said earlier just change them around daily um because obviously i don't really want to leave my living room like this all the time um but i want somewhere that i can just grab the toys and he can play with them as and when we need them so yeah it's been a successful morning so far. So this little one has been playing down here for the majority of the day. Are you enjoying that? Yeah. As you can tell, he's been having a whale of a time, so I'm really glad that I've done it. I think it was a good idea. Yeah, it was good, wasn't it? Yeah? So, um, my Amazon delivery came earlier and it was this Grow Anywhere blind that I ordered. It was Prime Day yesterday and today and this was reduced to 13 Um Yeah, it was. I asked on Instagram whether anyone would recommend it. Loads of people recommended this one or the Amazon version. So what I'm going to do is I'll link both of them in the description box down below in case um, anyone's interested. But basically, it's a blackout blind that you can travel with and it um goes on the window by with suction cups it's something that um we're gonna try because i don't think that the bedroom is dark enough for finley to sleep in of an evening and i think that's why we're struggling to get him to stay yeah to stay in your bed when we put him to bed of an evening um we're trying to get a bedtime routine um but at the moment he's not settling very easily like he struggles to self-settle anyway yeah you do <laughs> um yeah he struggles to self settle and then when he does fall asleep he sort of wakes up half an hour later and a lot of the um things i've read have suggested that it's environment based and a lot of the time it's because it's too light so we've got this one because i thought we could try it in our room if it works and we can put it in his room as well when he finally goes into there when we go away towards the end of the year we can take it with us um and it was only 13.99 in the sale yeah, it was. You having fun? He's still just wobbling around all over the place on the mat down here. He's having a whale of a time. And Molly Moo has just come in to, to see us. I think she's a bit confused as to what's going on because she's coming into the living room and she knows that she's not allowed anywhere near the mat or the rug. So <laughs> she just walks in, looks at him, turns around and goes back outside again and plays with her ball. She's been outside... I've been playing with their ball for a lot of the day as well, so yeah. yeah. But anyway, we've put dinner on. I've made spaghetti bolognese for dinner tonight, and it's in our cast iron dish, so I've just got it on low and it's cooking quite slowly um, so that I can sort him out and do bedtime routine and stuff like that um, because Ryan will be coming home late tonight because he's on a day shift. Daddy will be home later, won't he? Hopefully, he'll be bath and sort of in bed or getting ready to go to bed by then but he didn't sleep very long earlier for his last nap and now we're sort of getting to the point where he should be sort of be in the bath now but it's only what 20 to 6 yeah 20 to 6 so i don't know if that's going to be a bit too early but i don't know i might just give it a go and see what happens